Good morning! This is not exactly how I wanted to start our first week of Vlogmas with bedhead pyjamas on in our crazy mess of a house but this is how it is so welcome to Vlogmas! <laughs> So it is Sunday the 1st of December now and like I did share in a previous video I am not doing vloggers where I'm going to be uploading every day this year but I am going to be vlogging every day until Christmas this year and then every week on a Monday is going to be the previous week's vlogmas. So you'll see everything that we are up to this week and this week I'm not too sure how it's going to play out. We've got a crazy busy week. So you may see this now and be watching vlogmas week one part one because this week we are going to Iceland. I know it's not something I've been keeping from you. We literally booked it what five days ago we booked it on Tuesday and we go on Friday so that is super exciting meanwhile this week coming up we're having all the house transformed we've got new carpets coming we've got new bedroom furniture coming so we are finishing off all of the skirting and all the painting and ripping all the carpets up this weekend so it's crazy busy so I think what will probably happen is we'll have part one which is at home and part two which is in Iceland but yeah it's Sunday now this is our current situation. Lee is taking the doors off the hinges. Hello. <laughs> We've got the bed up against the window here. And yeah, we're just getting all this carpet up because look at this minging carpet. This is going finally. And we've already taken it up out here and in here. And we've finished doing all the skirts and painting work in here. It's looking much fresher. And this is the things from the bedroom now that are staying in here, but I can't believe how good it's starting to look but the rest of the house okay, okay. is a bit of a crazy situation what's Loki trying to do he's got something in his mouth he's trying to eat something Loki bum what have you eaten Loki what are you eating have you eaten it already you're not impressed are you with all this diy business no good babes okay so it is a couple of hours later now and we have made a lot of progress all the carpet has been ripped up in here and in the bedroom too now we've had to move things in alternate rooms like the bed is full this room is now full because this is where everything is going to live while they're doing the carpets when they've done everywhere else all this stuff is going to go in here and they can do the carpet in this room so this is my situation currently i look a little bit crazy but we're just going to run to the tip now to take all of that carpet and we're going to pick up some dinner as well or else need to eat today and then yeah recharge get back on it and then when we get home it's time to sand and paint which actually you think that's what you're doing but that is the that's the thing that takes up the least amount of time it's all the prep like moving everything about like my house downstairs is crazy let's go have a look are you ready to see this look look at the craziness of my house right now oh that is mental this is the entirety of my upstairs bare the furniture that's upstairs how crazy is that? And these poor little doggies in here. Oh babies, they're so sad. We've just got to stay out of the way. We don't want to hurt you, do we? And we don't want you to hurt yourselves either. Right? But you know we'll have loads of snuggles tonight. <laughs> crazy. Good babes. Oh, so. What time is it now, Lee? Eight o'clock? Oh man, I am shattered. We look disgusting as well, don't we, Lee? We need yeah. showers. <laughs> Radiant. Oh, we Come feel me in. <laughs> the dogs are all sad because they've been in the beds all day in here. Like we've got the baby gate up so they can see out, but they're just not happy. They just love this one. Loves. They've still got pen in his ear now. Loves to rub up against freshly painted yes. frames. But yeah, I will show you it when we go upstairs to bed. But more or less finished. Probably just a couple hours to finish off tomorrow. This was a big job that needed to be done. And we wasted a lot of time using that paint. We did. We basically repainted everywhere because we got a new one, which was one coat. Just go for so one coat. So basically, one coat was just proper gloss. Yeah. Gloss as it is meant to be, like thick and shiny and smooth. That was the one coat. Whereas we got one that was low order, and it was just low like, order, low cover. Yeah, and it was just rubbish. If we'd have done this, you've got paint on you still. If we'd have done this, That's all okay. this painting could be done. It we've been doing it for weeks. You live and you learn. So now we're having some tea, and I've got a wasabi takeout, and it's the chicken katsu yakisoba. Nom, 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 nom. It were new. Yeah. 
Lee's having a pizza. I deserve it. And then we're also having some pizza party spring rolls from Tesco's. And we're going to spend a little bit of time with these cherubs and then head straight up to bed because you know. We're tired. Good morning, it is Monday, and we are sat outside the gym now. This is what we do on a Monday, bright and early. It's about quarter we don't past just sit eight. Outside the gym. Let me go into the gym, we don't just sit outside <laughs> the gym. So, we're gonna head in and have a good workout now, and then we always follow that up with, don't mind Lee, with a little food shop to start the day off right. And we've got a boot full of charity shop bags as well, so we're gonna drop those off. But first things first, let's get this workout in. Couldn't find my water bottle this morning, so I've got my Disney's sci-fi dining water cup. I always turn up to the gym with some crazy things that I like, my coffee mug or, you know, a themed Disney mug. Got to be done, makes me a little bit happier. So yeah, let's go get this workout done. Good morning, it's Tuesday, and I know there wasn't much footage from yesterday, and that is because, sorry if it's echoing right now, that is because we had to finish getting the household prepped because today, it's new carpet day, yes! And also I had to do a little bit of self tan last night to make myself feel a bit better. So you can kind of tell I'm a little bit more bronzed. Put some makeup on today, did my hair, and obviously got my Walt Disney World top on. Right now I'm going to show you a little bit of a before. So we finished all the painting off, so I'm in the dressing room currently. We've just had to empty all the clothes off the bottom rail so that I can put the carpet in here. But this is a quick before of the dressing room. And we've realised it's actually very hard to get like a picture in here of a before. So hopefully you'll be able to tell it a bit better on video. Then out in the hallway, the banister is completely done now. So that looks so much better. All the stairs. And look at the woodwork, I mean, it just looks so much cleaner, it looks brand new. And then this is the room where we're putting everything to start with. Oh, I need to move this basket actually out of the way. And then the bedroom with all the doors, which we don't even know where we're going to put the doors. Or the bed yet. We're going to work it out, this is how we've been sleeping. Just like this for the last few nights, there is a lot of stuff over on that windowsill, but we're hoping that's going to be okay, so... Yeah, this is the before of everywhere. And you can't really see in here because it's a complete tip. But hopefully I'll be able to get a little picture while we move everything out of here. And then obviously everything's still in the bathroom as well. Now let me take you downstairs. Look at the state of my living room. This is mental. I feel like I'm living in a hoarder's house. Obviously, Christmas tree is still up, so that is exciting. And these poor little dogs in here. They've just been living in here for the last couple of days, bless them. But it'll all be worth it when I get my new carpet today. Cannot wait. Let the transformation begin. So they're here now. You'll be able to hear. Dogs are not impressed. Lots of bashing going on. But while that's going on, me and Lee, hey Lou, so... So. We're going to polish up the little door handles. So I think, since I've got some time, I'm going to spend some time clearing out some of the kitchen cupboards. So I know I've got to reorganise this one. I've got to clean out the cutlery tricks. Now it's crumbs in, and I need to organise this cupboard too. So maybe I'll start on the cutlery tray and just see how far we can get. There we go, how much better and neater does that look? So we've just got a couple of essentials in here. Spoons, forks, knives, big spoons. And then down the back here we've just got a couple of like the bigger things. Head out of my home, yes, one draw, done.
selling you carpets are in. They're all finished. It's half past 12, so it's taken them about three hours. So this is the end result. Now I'm still in the middle of hoovering up, <gasps> but this is them. Oh, it's everything I ever dreamed of. It's so luxurious and soft. So I've already hoovered this room. So this is the office. Look how nice this looks. Let's see if I can give you a little overview. Oh man, it just looks so nice. So I've done out here as well. Lee's currently putting the bed back together in the bedroom. Hey Lee. Hey. <laughs> and then out here. Still got a little bit more hoovering. We have already actually hoovered in here. But needs a bit more doing. And then out here on the landing, this is what it all looked like. So this is it going down the stairs. <laughs> just fluff absolutely everywhere. But it just looks amazing. So we've got half of the day left, which is really good. So it means I can hoover and we can start rearranging the house back to some kind of normality. And yeah, the mass organization begins. <laughs> all hoovered now although apparently we have gone for the fluffiest carpet known to man and it will still be getting fluffy for weeks but yeah oh and i've put the wallpaper sample back up there now as well to see what i think it might look like and i think actually i might be quite happy with it so now it's time to transform the house and bring in everything bring everything from downstairs and all of this and sort it out where it needs to go about to leave already packing come with me i'm not really asking we'll get away to a place where we don't know about to see the world in action what we can be life with no distractions we'll get away this is what we waited for day everything is not how it's going to look but it's back to how it was so here in the dressing room we've got like the leftover carpet which we're going to do something for the dogs with and then this is stuff that is all going to go up here but we need extra boxes and then i'm gonna have a floating shelf up here for my handbags all this is stuff that's going to be going in my bedroom when my new furniture arrives this week and this down this side da -da -da -da. but it is looking an awful lot better and then we'll come out here and the bedroom we've got the bed back up tonight we're going to be actually be able to sleep in a real life bed again that is so exciting look is clearly excited about that too and then in the office so we've got a couple of bits that we're needing to sell in here. So we're selling my dressing table and my drawers and also this big desk here. So, you know, if you are interested in either of these, drop us a comment, let us know they are for sale. This is a corner standing desk, but it's one of those electric ones that you press a button and it goes up and down. So if you are interested, let me know in the comments and I can get you a few more bits of information. 
And then these are still gonna be living here, but it's gonna be all reorganized. But we have a little bit of normality back now. And down here is looking a lot better now too. So obviously it's still not perfect, but if you can remember what it looks like this morning, it is an awful lot better. So the boxes that are still left there now are Christmas decorations. So I'm hopefully gonna be putting those out in the next couple of days. Oh, we need to bring that upstairs. That's the error, but yeah. We are getting there and then these baskets and bags that are still left down here are just what's going to go in the bedroom furniture too. So overall a successful day. I love my new carpets. They are awesome. The dog seems to like it too. It's so soft. Is it soft boys? Is it soft does? You like it don't you? You like it too Loki. We like the new carpets. So it is Wednesday now and me and Lee have come in to Leeds. We're doing a couple of filming bits today. We're filming a couple of Primark videos. So Lee's coming with me. I always like to, him to come with me. I feel a bit more confident and I just like spending the time with him as well. So yeah, we'll probably have a look around a few different bits. But like I say, I'm filming three videos. So there's gonna be quite a lot of footage that I want to get. So it's very loud in here, but we've come to Wagamama's. Yes, for some lunch with this one. Done all my Christmas shopping in Primark now. There's a little peek, so you could, should go check out those videos, but I think I'm gonna get my usual, which is this. Nicks and Kicks mango and ginger figatsu. So that is amazing. And then to start with, I'm going to get the Yasai Gyozas. Yum, yum, yum. Oh my word, so we're stopping by the Lego store and look at this Disney Lego set. This is awesome. It's like the train station that they have in Magic Kingdom. <gasps> Disney Railroad. Oh my god, that is so fun. Oh, so I've just finished up at IKEA now. They just been taking the trolley back. I did want to vlog a little bit in IKEA, but they had like just chart music on, didn't they? And Christmas music, so I couldn't get any of that. Because... Know, tip, would you? No, I'm alright, thanks. You can keep it. It's a tip. Oh what? man. You've got a tip, would you? <laughs> so we've got a couple of bits for the dressing room. I'm excited to get that done. We really want to get that started tonight, but first I need to edit tonight's video. So we'll get the video editing done ASAP. Oh yeah, I forgot about that. So we need to go to the range now. We're gonna go see if we've got a wax melt burner. We have too many wax we melts. We do, and we need some candles, and Lou was like, well, we've got loads of wax melts, and it's better for you for money, so we're gonna see if they've got a burner for just a couple of pounds, and you know, we'll probably get lost in the range, looking so a little bit as well. But. So we are home now, and I've got my laptop here. I'm just uploading my video. I managed to edit in, rec edit it in record time tonight. So we've come upstairs now and Lee has put these together that we got from Ikea. It's just these baskets to go in the big Kallax unit. We've already got eight of them and I've got another four of them. So we're gonna fill these up because that's what we do on date night, isn't it Lee? <laughs> well, what Lee just said is really rude and we'll be edited out. <laughs> so this is what we're doing tonight for date night. Yeah, let's get it sorted. go here's a little overview of how the unit is looking i know it does look slightly worse but that's because we're still waiting on a few bits arriving tomorrow and it still won't all be done for a while because you know we've got other bits going on we do have to continue the rest of our lives but i'm really happy with how this shelving unit looks for now at least anyway so that is going to be it from me tonight now i'm ready to get in my pjs and watch the apprentice in bed with lee so yeah we're going to be signing out and i shall see you in the morning and it is very exciting because tomorrow we're getting our new bedroom furniture delivered yes good morning it's thursday and today i have been finishing putting the rest of my christmas decorations up so we're going to rewind in time now and you're going to see me doing that <laughs>
up at the top of the stairs is what I am calling my fun Christmas tree. So this is a silver six foot pop up tree. And I think it's from being cute and it was actually at my mum's years ago and then we pinched it and never gave it back. So now I put it here every year. It's got our original angel on the top, which is from Asda. I made a cute little bow and then it just comes with these lights already and these baubles. And I've just got a couple of personalised ones that we've had over the years that my mum made for us. Bella on again and that's Ozzy there when he was a pup. We've got our first Christmas also from my mum on there. I say my mum, it's my mum and dad but we all know it's mum's really. So yeah, this is the fun Christmas tree. And then I've put my tree skirt from last year down on the bottom here they're walking in a winter wonderland bit but it's it is way too big for this space so you can just see the winter wonderland bit and i thought that looked good and i'm really happy with how it looks with the new carpet too so now let's go downstairs and see the other bits i've put up so i have finished putting the garland together now don't mind Loki just coming over the back of the sofa i'm really impressed with how it's turned out this year as well so this is the garland that matches the tree and then I left these on actually from last year. There's just a couple of different decor bits. And then what I've done is I like wrapped some ribbon around it and made some bows. And then I just did it in this swinging garland style and tied it on with some thread and then finished it off with these. So it's actually secured, you see, on by that as well. And yeah, just absolutely love it. This one is so sparkly, this ribbon that I got from Primark. Oh, you have to love it. And now we are in the dressing room. <laughs> and Lee's about to put a shelf together for me. Oh, yes. So it's going up here and it's going to house my handbags. So I'll be able to put all of my bags together this afternoon. Yes, so the new bedroom furniture has arrived. This is exciting. So this one is a big tall boy. So we're going to see whether we want it here or here. How easy do you reckon it's going to be to move it? I don't like it over there. I'm sure we'll find a way. <laughs> I'm so excited. I'm going to put it all together. now i've already been out and done some clients oh yes Oz. and i've come back now and lee's finished putting it all together for me and look at my bedroom obviously it's not all finished completely yet but it looks so good i don't even know if you're gonna be able to tell how good it actually looks on camera as well so walk into the bedroom and we've got my new dressing table and stool and then obviously my new bedside table with my new lamp on it and then this side of the bed, we've got a tall boy. This has still got polystyrene on that needs to come off. I absolutely love it here as well. And then Lee's got his bedside table with lamp on it as well. But yeah, I absolutely love it. I mean, it's just so good. This is the Knightsbridge range from my furniture. And oh my God, why is it so blurry? Hello, focus on me. There we go. But yeah, it's so good. And I've also got a package come now. And this is either going to be... Oh, new bedding or new curtains. So let's see which one it is. So it is my bedding that has arrived. And it is this. Can you see it's like a pin tuck style? But it's a lot lighter than the one on the picture. This is like the actual colour of it. So obviously we're not going to get that on with being away right now. But I think we'll probably put it on in the new week. But yeah, super exciting. And now I need to go and make tea. And I need to continue on with doing everything else. So my dressing room is still looking a complete mess, but I've given myself a schedule. So I'm gonna have tea now. And then I'm gonna give myself till six o'clock to get everything in the house finished. And then at six o'clock, I'm gonna give myself an hour to do my packing and then an hour to get myself sorted because I want to like shave my legs and tan. And I did want to do my toenails, so. I don't think I'll have time for shellac, but I might have time just to do a regular polish, which I haven't done in ages. But yeah, that is the plan. I'm gonna go make some tea. Here we go. So I am all packed for Iceland now. 
look this is let me show you this way around this is the least amount of stuff i have ever packed in my entire life and i know people are like you're only going for two nights so that's why you've got so little but honestly i've been away for two nights before and taken way more i've been away for a night before and taken way more but i think i've just been proper on it this time i've been really good so yeah that is my suitcase and then here's what i'm wearing tomorrow i just need to get my boots and my coat out as well i've got a little bum bag just to keep all my essentials in so that I've got that to take out during the day with me. Got a hat for tomorrow and then I've got like my scarf and my gloves in there still and I managed to put an extra hat and glove set in that I wanted to take so that's really good and then this is what I'll be wearing on the plane tomorrow and then tomorrow daytime. So yeah that means I've even managed to pack an extra outfit in in case we get changed on Saturday night and want to do something fancy. Well not fancy, I've just got like a nicer jumper and then I've got like my furry muff hat and like your little muff thing that you put your hands in so i've even managed to fit those in and a little thing that goes like around your ears and your head so yeah super excited now all that's left for me to do is get in the shower and shave myself and bathe myself and do my tan and i want to do my toenails too so that's hello princess the little girls come wandering in they know when we get the suitcases out what it means it's okay granddad's gonna come and look after you he is, isn't he? You precious girl. So yeah, I think I'm going to end this portion of the vlog here now. I hope you have enjoyed watching and that you are super excited for part two, which is going to be my Iceland vlog and vlogmas week one part two. So please give it a big thumbs up if you are super excited for that one and I'll see you on the next video. Bye! <laughs>